more though to get us through the rapids. I feel the jet ski already being like pulled in. It's like whirlpools just up here. There you go, I see a gap right there. Go for it, go for it, go for it. Right there, right there, right there, Nigel. Right there. Good morning to you all and welcome back to my channel. Uh, if you're new here, my name is Nigel, the channel is Nigel's Cheap Vlogs and on this particular day we're going to be doing a uh, sea do adventure. Right, I'm all set. Let's go wait for Mark to show up. Mind you, I am early. I did say 9 o'clock and it is uh, 8.55, so any second now you'll probably show up. But I'm ready. There he is. <laughs> I'm pretty good. How you doing, Mark? Wonderful. Uh, I just checked it out. Yeah. Uh, it's a paying deposit, the envelope kind of style thing. Just over there in front of me is uh, Fort Niagara State Park and somewhere over here is uh, the Ontario side, Canada side of Fort George and we're going to head off down there very shortly and see how far we can get up the Niagara River before it gets too dangerous. Uh, the river itself runs about 56 kilometers from here to uh, the entrance of the mouth where, where it starts at Lake Erie, which we've done in a previous video, but well, we're doing the second half of it now. And another interesting fact about the uh, Niagara River is it runs north. Not many rivers actually run north. Uh, so that's very peculiar. Uh, but of course, the way the lakes are set up, Lake Erie is set higher than Lake Ontario, hence the waterfalls at Niagara Falls, which of course are the fastest uh, waterfalls in the world. And also it produces some of the fastest rapids in the world. Uh, but I don't know how far we're gonna get up there, but we're gonna try without putting ourselves in danger to try and get to some of those rapids, but not the really dangerous ones. So anyway, I'm going to catch up with Mark and uh, let's go. All right, before we uh, tackle the river, I just need to point out one thing very important. I am still very new to the jet ski world, very new. This is my first ski and I've only been riding for nearly eight weeks right now. So this is my biggest, biggest challenge to date. In the past eight weeks, I've put on 40 hours on the ski in various conditions. So uh, this is gonna be a good test.
Wow, look at these. Whirlpools. The first bit. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Let's do this. We've had a little prep talk for emergencies. Uh, what to do uh, for safety if anything goes wrong. So we've just done all that off camera. And uh, now we're going to enter the first stage. Right ahead of me is the Queenston Lewiston Bridge. Or the Lewiston Queenston Bridge. All right. Oh yeah, oh my god, you can feel the you feel the jet ski already being like pulled in. It's like whirlpools just up here. So you can see this, these little rapids here. Look at that. Alright, let's go. Oh my god. That's kind of weird to look on the eye. Very weird. 130 feet deep. 150 feet. Oh my god, that's all whirlpool. That was scary. <laughs> I did not like that. <laughs> Alright. Stay to the side. Gonna pull them off. 151 feet.
of Christ. Ha <laughs> ha! It could be Jambo! I'd rather be on that than in this! Ha <laughs> ha! Alright, let's try and get out of this little bit here. Hey, right, jet boat, come in. Okay, I feel better now, I'm over here. A big weight. All right, ride it out, ride it out, ride it out. All right, here we go. There we go. No. Whoa! Did not like that. Jesus. Hey, that weight nearly killed me. That was scary. <laughs> caught me off it was like out there oh my god holy shit Yeah, it looks it. All oh, the rainfall. Yeah. Oh. I will. Right, he's gonna lead the way, and I'm gonna stick right behind him if I can. There we go. Jet boat coming. again. Just gonna wait for that weight to die down. All right. right there and I'll call it a day. <laughs>
right, Mark, I think we're going to call it a day, buddy. Uh, I don't like this anymore. <laughs> Compression rapids. If you get sucked in, if you fall off and get sucked in, the chances are they're not going to find you for a week. You're going to get sucked right down to the bottom. And the further we go up, the worse we are. So I'm going to call it right here where, where Mark is and turn round. Um, I'm at my limit now for safety, I think. A comfort zone. Like Mark said, the, the, the water levels are a lot faster this time than he came last time. Rock there! Oh! Yeah, I'm done. I can't go any further. No, a bit. Yeah, it got a bit nerve-wracking that little bit there. Stay that side. All right. Holy shit! All right, and follow him. All right. This is nothing like what I was like when I came. It was quiet in this, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Well, we Shit, sorry, Mark. <laughs> we're just going to wait for the jet boat to go, and we're going to try and follow his wake and find our way out of here. Oh, look at that! <laughs> hey, Tom Baker, this is for you, man. <laughs> All right, the current's really pulling me now. So, holy shit! Just... All right, that wake's virtually gone now, so we can turn around and start heading back. Yeah, the. Ooh. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, you lead, yeah. <laughs> let's just hope going back is easier. I got a pretty clean it won't be. <laughs>
By the way, that's America. That's America right there, right there, America. Look how close we are. 